Welcome back to Fallout 4. <laughs> All right. Well, as uh, the last uh, part of uh, last episode, uh, we did the uh, Prove You're Worthy to Join the Adam Cats quest. And, uh, you know, that was a matter of heading over there. Whoops. To, uh... over to Warwick Place and fix something over there. And now I have to come over here and turn this quest in. Okay. And let's see. Okay. Quest Lady isn't here, so let's look around. Maybe over in the other digs where the pool hall is. And by the way, I have to say it, but hanging around here, I can't help but to expect the Fonz to walk in at any time. <laughs> it's that kind of place, you know? It really is. Okay. Yo. Job's done. All done. Why, well, certainly. You're gonna have to give me something harder than that. That was just the first test, Buster. Don't get big headed. <laughs> that place was a real dump, huh? Thanks for taking care of our business there. Yeah, and June says thanks. June sends her thanks. That June is a doll, and her Milo cakes are the most far out thing I have ever tasted. Just so you know, I will be checking your work. Mylurk cake? Yuck. So she had the skills to stiff up the Warwick pumps. <laughs> Should we rustle her jimmies with something else? Oh boy. All right. Get out the way. And where are they? Okay. An assaultron? Are you kidding me? Shoot, talk gun it. Okay, gunners are down, Zeke wants to talk. Okay, Z-Man, what do you got? <clears throat> gunners! Those wet rags keep trying to get their mitts on our suits. <laughs> you slave! Repeatedly. We didn't lose a single cat today. Well, if you say so. Whatever you say. Well, I say you are righteous, out of sight, and with it. And an official friend of the Adam Cats. You have full reign of our digs. And, well, uh, you know, that's cool. You hooked up with a little discount around here. Yeah. Finally, the holy grail for anyone who knows what's cool in the Commonwealth. Your very own Adam Cats jacket. Wear it well, Jack. Okay. All right. Well, obviously, of course, the first thing I'm going to do is loot all of these former gunners. Yeah. Because I'd notice that the NPCs, be they good guys or bad guys, don't loot anything. 
They just don't. Well, that's just as well, because if they did, then you'd have to fight them for the loot. All right, any out here? Well, I'm not seeing any. I know there's got to be at least a couple of more in here. And they had an Assaultron. That is no joking matter. All right, come on. Move just a tweensy bit faster. I know there's one over here. Get this stuff looted up. And I am absolutely going to be taking advantage of this situation and getting myself hooked up with a full set of Adam Katz T-60 power armor. What I'm going to have to do first, however, is uh, make up the scratch for that because, well, I have back at my Red Rocket a whole mess of Raider and Gunner gear, armor, weapons, and all kinds of stuff like that. A real royal load of stuff. And it shouldn't be any big deal at all to uh, crank up the necessary coinage to be outfitting with armor. Okay, I'm not seeing anything else here that needs to be looted. So, I'm going to head back up to my red rocket and gather up stuff maybe stop at diamond city and do some sales and then uh, head back down here to see about some t60 stuff so i will catch you in a bit all right i am back here at my red rocket and i've been doing a little housekeeping uh in here uh, where I have been keeping various and sundry apparel, I've decided that there's a few things I'm going to keep, but most of it is now over here to be sold. I need the caps, and uh, I would rather have the caps than to have most of this stuff. Uh, the, the only stuff... The only apparel that I'm carrying that I will not be selling is the stuff that I actually have equipped. And the same thing goes for this cabinet here, where I've been keeping weapons and such. Weapons and ammo. Uh, I've been through it. The stuff that I wish to keep is either in that cabinet or equipped. Everything else goes. I mean, I acquire more on a fairly regular basis, so it's not a problem. And I've uh, learned another little tidbit, which, I mean, it's easy to notice it if you take the time to look at stuff. If you look here in Aid, and you look at Grape Mentats, which you can make in the chemistry station. They give you the effect that you buy for 10% lower and you sell for 10% higher. That, combined with the uh, discount that Adam Katz said that I would get for buying stuff there, I think I'm not going to have any problem loading up on T60 power gear at least a full suit and who knows maybe a second full suit just for the heck of it in the meantime i am now heading back to the adam cats garage it's going to take rather a while because right now i'm carrying five thousand pounds of stuff 
and a good 4,500 pounds of it is stuff that I intend to sell. So I'm going to go to the Adam Katz garage by way of Diamond City's vendors and any other vendors or traders that I may run into along the way. Because sometimes I run into folks like Trash Can Carla and so on uh, that do the trading thing and they travel a lot as they do so. So I'm going to sell what I can, as much as I can. And uh, what I don't sell will be up for just plain flat out trade at the Cat's Garage. And yeah, so I will catch up with you when I get to the garage. All right, just getting back to the garage, and yeah, did pretty good in Diamond City with selling stuff. I left uh, three merchants with no caps left at all. <laughs> I cleaned them out pretty good. Uh, you say so. All right, where is this rowdy person that does... Oh, there she is. Yo! We could use a few more suits around here. Let's do some hey, business. You want to spiff up your power armor? You've come to the right place. The well, you could say that. Most far out mods, this side of the apocalypse. All right, show me what you got. I've got a few minutes to browse. All right. Okay. And now, wait a minute. I forgot to do something. So I'm going to back out of that. Go down here. Inventory aid. And let's see. Where is it? Here we are. Grape Mentats. You get your buying prices 10% lower. You sell, you sell for 10% higher. And it jumps your charisma by 5 points. And the effect lasts for 8 minutes yeah you can do a lot of business in eight minutes and this stuff will help you uh pass persuasion checks and stuff like that too so one great mentat and now hi don't let your suit get stale Clyde get yourself a new mod yeah okay sure let's take a look okay now Prices are a whole lot better. I mean, with the discount combined with the Grape Mentats. So, T60, helmet, left arm, right, left leg, right arm, right leg, torso. And let's see here. Don't need the T45 stuff or the 51. Although, maybe later on. Let's see. Power armor frame to mount it all on. Okay. Now, go over to my inventory over here. We'll start with weapons, sure. Uh, let's see. I have a whole boatload of stuff that I'm prepared to offload here, so to just... Basically, everything that I don't have equipped is up for bids here. There's like a 82 pipe pistols. You know, that ought to take a good bunch off the price. Yeah, it did. Okay, now I'm on the good here, so I gotta be careful about letting that one run out, but shouldn't be a problem. Thirty-six double barrel shotguns. Alright, Rowdy, what you got? Uh, ammo. 
you got fusion cores. I'll take one of those. Oh, did I go too far here? <laughs> it looks like I did. All right, sort this by value. I think it's just sorting mine by value. All right. I don't want them to be minus. I don't mind bringing them down to zero, but I don't want to bring it down to minus because that means they're getting stuff for nothing. No, I don't want to get any of the pool cues back. All right, I'm going to let it go at that right there. Accept, confirm. Power frame is out, out outside the garage. Okay, cool. All right. I might pick that up later, but okay. All right. Power armor frame, uh, this one. Okay, transfer. The fusion core that has the least charge left on it. The more those deadhead gunners show their mugs around here, I'm really I was practically behind it. And I had to walk her all the way around, huh? All right, let's put these pizzas on here. Oh, yeah, looking good. All right, let's load it up. Beautiful camera angle there. <laughs> all right. Oh, yeah. Not bad. Okay. And this is the T60 stuff that's got a lot going on. And I think uh, when I get this thing... I don't care. Jeez, come on. I'm talking here. Okay. Now that we got this in order... This has been hanging for some time, and the reason is, if I look at the map location, you'll notice it's hollowed out, which means I haven't been there before, and normally, the Scribe Halen quests and the Night Reese quests, I go ahead and do those off camera and whatnot, but I decided that it would be reasonable to... Uh, restrict myself to doing the uh, ones that I have not been to before. You know, when there's a location I haven't been to at least once, then that one I need to go ahead and do on camera. I think that's just a reasonable way to do it. So I am off to Trinity Plaza to take care of that so that I can get back to doing my thing and gaining the levels and XP and all that stuff that goes with it. So, I'll catch you there. All right, it looks like I have found the place. The trick is going to be finding the entrance. Actually, the entrance should be right up here. It's 
should be right where that marker is. Oh, I get it. We get to go in this way, through the basement. Okay. This sounds good to me. All right. Wish a bucket would show up. I'd rip his legs clean no grease off here. Getting hungry. Ah. Uh, I smell super mutants. Physically very powerful. Mentally very atrophied. Or, to put it another way, strong as a stump and almost as smart. It's okay, Bunky. We'll spice things up for you. Won't we? All you gotta do is just stick your head out where I can see it. Reminds me, one of my recent creations in the weapons workbench. And if I go over to weapons, oh, there it is. And if I hit X to inspect, we've got a very nice 50 caliber sniper rifle. 102 damage, 185 range, accuracy 112. Oh, yeah. This baby is very deadly. Okay, there's my objective over there. The trick... getting up onto that level. Unless I can do this. There we go. Oh good. They keep some of the nastiest things around. There we go. Just one hit, a super mutant skirmisher. Well, that's just your upper lip. Just your upper lip. Yep, I will. Just as soon as I teach you to lay down. There. That wasn't so hard now, was it? Oh, there's another in here. Okay, let's not go getting overconfident. Quick save. Take the minigun. Okay, 
let's loot this stuff. So they had a mole rat problem too. There. Lay down. Good doggy. Okay. I think that's everybody. Very nice. Very good. Okay. That gets this finished. Now I can head over to see Scribe Halen and hand this one in. Pick up another one. Hopefully it will be something that I have a location that I have been to before. I do love this whole thing where you don't take fall damage in this thing. That is really nice. Okay. All right. I'm going to get out of here and go see Scribe Halen. All right. Here we go. Yeah, got it. No problem. Great. I'll get this documented and ready to send off. Here's I'll always want more tech, so believe me, I'll never run short of missions. Let me know if you think you can handle another run. Okay, now quick save and hit. I'm ready, and if it works out, great. If not, I F9 and do it again. Affirmative. That's what I like to hear. I'm off the location on your map. Stay alert. Poseidon Reservoir? Oy. Show me on the map. Oh, boy. Okay. I'm going to F9 and do that again. Yeah, let's try this again. Affirmative. Good. Areas on your map. Good luck. Poseidon Reservoir again. What is this? Okay. Affirmative. That's what I like to hear. I mark the location on your map. Stay alert. Poseidon Reservoir again. Well, I guess I'm going to end up doing Poseidon Reservoir. How about that? This uh, reload it and try it again thing doesn't seem to be working so good for me. New paint job? Wow. Okay. So... I'm going to head out to Poseidon Reservoir. I may stop at the rocket and uh, put some stuff away and do a little bit of tinkering first. But uh, next time, Poseidon Reservoir. And yeah, we'll see what's out there. Thanks for watching. Take it easy. I am out of here. <laughs>